Hello, I'm Henry Lee of BlueHeronArts.com. Now I'm going to show uh, three seal engraving process. Three seals, um, the design and the engraving process. First seal uh, I'm to do is uh, uh, a name seal for Spencer Rudol. And uh, you can find a uh, website I uh, will list it under the um, video in the video description uh, where you can find the corresponding uh, Chinese uh, characters um, and uh, the you know the most frequently used uh, in the Chinese names for male uh, or female so you can specify your personal traits and uh, get the, uh, the recommendations so for the last name we use the Lu because uh, um, RU is not a uh, uh, common Chinese character. Uh, there's no equivalent to Chinese character. So we use this uh, Lu. There may be different ones, but this one I like uh, uh, very close um, as a continent. Um, and the, this one um, from derived from S, uh, Xie. The meaning is harmony. And uh, you can uh, combine with another character derived from uh, S, uh, C, Spencer, right? So, uh, Bing. Spencer. Uh, I'm sorry, P. S, P. So, uh, Bing. Uh, Xie Bing. That's where I think the website suggests. And uh, this one is the cultivated or well bred. So after you got the name, you can find uh, some other website to generate a computer font seal. Uh, but they won't look uh, very sophisticated, actually more uh, mechanical than a hand design one like this. Uh, this one, these ones I collected from uh, various uh, uh, references, uh, both online and offline, and I generated a special seal called the uh, uh, nine curves, nine curves. Uh, uh, cell script is a common script used by the imperial uh, Chinese officials, uh, bureaucrat bureaucracy, um, as the agent. Uh, I mean, the bureaucracy seal, the guanyin or official seals. So, Judea or nine curves style, but later uh, it become arti artistic style that you can use, so common people can always uh, can also use after Imperial China, before you can only use in the official seals. So there are you know, decorative uh, curves, and this is the version that the customer picked. So I'm going to do this seal first, and uh, then we'll come to the other three. By the way, if you order three sales, you get a better uh, carving service discount. Um, so you can order your name sales and the uh, mood sales together. Um, the carving actually is uh, um, less than an hour, but the design it takes most of the time. So you cannot, uh, I cannot show you the design until you place your order. Uh, please understand the process. So first you need to place the order if you want, and then I'll do the preview. Now I'm going to do the actual carving. The carving is uh, uh, very interesting to watch, so I, I usually document it with a video camera. So you can watch it on uh, YouTube. This is a special stone called the Xiu Jade. It's kind of soft jade, very fine and uh, very hard as uh, jade. It's still uh, coverable. The, the actual jade is not uh, uh, going to carve. I mean, it's not coverable, but this kind of soft jade it's okay, so you can see it's very delicate, but it's still hard. So, 
for hard stone, you can kind of cut like that. When you push, it would be too slippery, you know. It's good to have the kind of rough uh, feeling in the, as in the antique uh, seals. This is usually a bronze. Um, official seal. So we try to convey that kind of feeling in a cast bronze seal. R with the rust you know, the used kind of antique. <coughs> this first character is um, taken two spaces. That's why where the, you know, the more curves comes in. This positive carving is very challenging sometimes. You cannot make it uh, back if you lose the stroke. It's good that stone is uh, very fine, so you will not chip that much. It's good for this style. That's why I choose this style. Not all the stones suitable for this. The corner should be very careful. Don't cut through. Actually, there's roundness in the crossing intersections. Professional in sewing where we like to do you know all the same uh, directions at uh, once, so they don't have to turn the stone all the time. Sometimes I like to follow the sequence of stroke, but not always easy to, to especially with this uh, big uh, tool that we're using the seal bed. It's kind of difficult to turn all the time. So I just follow the more uh, professional way. So just carve all the strokes in one direction and then turn it around. To the other directions. Okay, now I'm down to the last character, being or cultivated. Um, the strokes uh, is uh, also in curvy style, the nine curve style, uh, to create a maximum uh, uh, stroke in terms of uh, negative space uh, this, to make it even. You know, the, that requires a lot of detail, so I use a very small knife, so delicate, I cannot even count. I have to do it uh, with a uh, feeling. This uh, site is the character, the radical forest, I mean. A lot of uh, vertical strokes. I try to make the strokes all different with the kind of rhythm. So there is no mechanical but more a 
organic. Hard, uh, you know, like a hand carved. carved. The, the spheres are not even, supposedly. Some may broke on purpose. Some may connect on purpose. Some effects that like the ink merged uh, based on a very uh, delicate work planned and executed by carving. So every time this effect will stay the same, although there are some you know, variations in ink. But uh, some effect you can control. Okay, now I'm uh, I'm done with the carving, initial uh, carving, and uh, I'm going to make a um, imprint, and then we we'll do the fine tuning. design of my own. So every step is a recreation of the um, art. Okay. Wow, I love the antique look and feel. It's much natural than uh, even when I try to design. So I just need to even some strokes. This part is probably too thick. Okay, now after some fine tuning, I'm going to make a second imprint. This positive in, uh, seal, you don't need to press that hard as the negative one. You want to keep the strokes fine and you know, thin. So um, I think I'm done. This is very classical um, official seal script, you know, nine curve style seal script. Okay, now I'm going to make an official seals for the, my uh, collection album and uh, also for the client.
press even, you don't have to press that hard for positive seal. You want a fine line. Okay. It's a little bit grainy, but if you press harder, it will be thicker. Less grainy. Let me try that on this side. Also, load more ink. The Shuan absorbent paper takes more ink. Computer paper is less absorbent or not absorbent. I usually blow some uh, moisture from my mouth to make it uh, more solid. See, this is much darker, right? Here was the first one. This is what I want. Okay. Just make another one for the client. Thank you, Spencer and uh, um, Sharon, for your special orders. And uh, I will continue this series of three. Please uh, stay tuned. Thank you. Bye bye.